Afro picks. It's our pick of some powerful African songs and our interpretation of it. Afro picks is this uh, really great tribute to some of the best African songs ever written. Uh, it's interesting because we're in New York, and even though you know there's all these places to rehearse, there was a fire where we we're supposed to rehearse, so we moved. So. In addition to the musicians improvising, the whole crew of people, the film crew, the organizers, were all improvising to make this happen. Well, it really starts with the invited guests. I want to work with people that I know that can deliver magic. Macy Gray and Amp Feeler, Auntie Ballas, and all these people, and Tony and Quest. It's a musical experiment, you know? It's not something like this kind of thing happens all the time. Paris is you know, maybe the most liberal-minded audience for music on Earth. You forgot where you came from. You forgot where you came from. I was the Eden where all was free. Of flamingos and the monkeys that are leaping wildebeest. But you crossed bridges and sailed the sea. And you went so far till you didn't look like me. Afrobeat because my music is going to be played. It's music of, uh, you know, of protest. It's very spiritual and it's the kind of thing that never gets old. It's just so inspiring and I think it goes straight to the heart of everyone. Tony Allen, he's really the beat master. He's the guy who Questlove has built this project around. I definitely know that Tony Allen has invented a style and I've listened to that style and I made it into my own. You know, two of the best drummers that ever lived and uh, I'm really honored to, that they invited me to be a part of it. He's gonna bring the Africanness and, and Quest is gonna bring the african Americanness, and we're gonna put it together and see where we come from. Both of us think in terms of who. He expresses excitement and colors outside the line. And I express discipline. So it makes for a very good mixture. Break. One, two, three, four. Break. There was, was a time when I David Murray did a really great job of uh, recreating the Tony Allen song. And it's funky, you know, it's, it just feels really good. And the horn arrangements are good. Well, now I'm back and all on fire. I got a lot of love to burn. You know, aside from all the politics, you have to remember things that are timeless, that have nothing to do with politics, like love and emotion. And so I think in that way, the repertoire of the concert is very balanced. You know, we have some stuff that's very political and some stuff that's very um, emotional and transcendental. first thing that comes to my mind is how to exploit the two wonderful voices that we have between Amp Fiedler and Macy Gray. At some point, they have to sing together. And that's a way of uniting the members of the band, members of the ensemble together. Amp has this really sexy, like really just beautiful voice. And my voice is a little rough, so the challenge has been just to to sound sweeter than him, but I can't do it, so. 